today I will show you how I create a Jane Austen inspired tea table. Again for another tea time in the afternoon and the last time I did a video like this you all enjoyed it and it was more of a Victorian English tea so today I wanted to create a Jane Austen Regency era tea time inspired by Jane Austen herself and also by so many of the beautiful historical period movies and series that have been coming out one of my favorites in the past year or two was a series called Sanditon, and it kind of brought back the life of Jane Austen's novel that has been forgotten, that was never finished. But today I wanted to recreate the romance and feminine table that comes from the Regency period. It all consists of some very simple things, and that includes candles. So I have candles here. In fact, this colonial candlestick is one I found in an antique store recently. I have been looking for one of these that you can hold. And this is beautiful and reminiscent of that era. I found these candle holders also at an antique store. Uh, you can just look around, always look for candles, candlestick holders, and you will have a definite table of romance. Also, teapots. I cannot stress how important teapots are for your table. I collect teapots and I have a wonderful collection that I started when I first got married 23 years ago. But this particular teapot is a special one I found at a thrift store and it is a blue and white. So today I'm doing a blue and white tablescape also mixed with a little bit of pinks because my teacup and my saucer are pink. We have to remember in those days, sometimes women that were not affluent or wealthy, they didn't have money to be able to purchase an elaborate set of china dishes. And many of the women in those days just had an eclectic collection like I kind of have here. And they would mix and match. This is a beautiful pink bone china from England, which I absolutely love. All of these china dishes are from England, which is very important, I think, to me because I am doing a Jane Austen inspired table. I also added a little Italian spode here, holding my little tea biscuits. In those days, I know a lot of the women, they ate tea biscuits. And so it's like a little tiny cracker of sorts, but I do have those and my little dish and also my napkins. So very important that the women also had uh, beautiful tablecloth, lace was very important. I do love to decorate also with doilies and such and all sorts of laces. And many of these doilies and laces and tablecloths have been passed down from my mom and also my grandma, but you can find them 
everywhere. Antique stores, thrift stores have lots of these types of linens. But for us, we can be able to find treasures in the antique stores and in the thrift stores that we can recreate the same feel and aesthetics and atmosphere that the women in those times had. Thank you for joining me for today's tea time. I hope you enjoyed seeing how I created a Regency Jane Austen inspired table. I enjoyed sitting here having tea with you and talking a little bit about the Regency era. And if you're new here, welcome and be sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and more. And I will see you in my next video.